What's up guys? Today we're gonna be doing another box, but it's not gonna be a snack box. It's going to be a mystery item box from FYE. It's an FYE exclusive, and it says Dookie Dookie on it. That's how you say Dookie in Japanese, right Snack? Yeah. All it says is five to seven items per crate, and this was a supply drop and we out here, okay? <laughs> Let's open it up. It says, we love you. I hope they do. And I hope they gave us good items because this costs $35. Not 35 Japanese dollars, but 35 US dollars for the FYE exclusive. So we have to consult some scissors and we'll be right in this box. Don't touch me, I'm sterile. Extraction. So let's open up the dookie dookie. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. What is that? Oh, look at him. Look at him. Let's see what we got. First item, go snack! Okay, so I'm pretty sure this thing that you called a cat is uh, actually a raccoon. Uh, nah, nah. AKA Trash Panda. Maybe. <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> oh, Trash Panda. It's a keychain. What if it's a fox? Maybe that. There's supposed to be a little magazine thing in here that tells us what these things are. Is this the magazine thing that's supposed to tell us what these things are? Hold on. It's a raccoon slash Fox slash panda slash cat. Trash panda. Trash panda. And no did. one's gug it out. Uh, wait, socks. Who doesn't need a good pair of Hello Kitty socks? You want to test drive these? Since right. you're not going to test drive the socks, I guess I will. <laughs> my foot's too big. They're way too big. Girl, honey, these are my good socks. These are my toe warmers. Oh, yeah. Now we're gonna have to clean the counter. Nah, nah. They have to. Hello Kitty socks out here. 10 out of 10 definitely will keep your feet warm or toes warm if it uh, if it ever got cold enough in Florida. Ooh. Nothing. It's a snack container. <laughs> Try to put you in a snack container. <laughs> nah. I will use this zero times. I could use that. Okay, for what? Like one piece of sandwich? For my lunch, yeah. I mean, I could put like... Carrots. Carrots. You put your carrots yeah. in there. Snack! Pick up an item! I have an eyeball on this item here. Comes in a nice little box. I don't know if you can see. It is a soy sauce saucer. And soy sauce saucer. It's got a little doggy in it, so that when you pour soy sauce in it, it illuminates the doggy figure. Let's see if it works! All right guys, so we got some soy sauce. We're gonna see if the dish matches what's on the box. All right, send it, honey. Looks beautiful. How sad. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, we, we Maybe did. A little bit. Okay, let's let's dump it out and let's try again because that's that's not even that didn't work at all. Whoa, this is a ripoff. Oh, you you have to pour it out like once you use it all. Oh. I wonder if I just pour like just a little bit on top of that. Let's see after you pour it out. Okay, all right, oh, that's how you do it. Cool. You just a little bit, a little bit goes a long way with this. It, see, they don't expect an American to be using this. No, they don't. No, this is a, oh, that, that looks that resembles it like almost perfectly. I know that's so cool. They, okay, this is one of the first items that they actually have that the description and the picture matches what it actually does. Oh, okay, I, I see the marketing here. That that that's worth thirty-five dollars by itself, if you ask me. That, that's ass quality, Honey Bottom. I like it. I like it. We're gonna keep that. Now, if only they put a sushi roll in here for us to test drive, I like that a lot. We Yes, we did waste quite a bit of soy sauce, but I, that's quality. It's cute. I like that. Next item. Shoe. Shoe soy sauce. Now it smells like soy sauce in here. Now I want some sushi. All right, snack. Ah! It's a Happy Cat kitchen sponge. So we can do all the dishes that are sitting, see, this is when we needed those scissors, see? Scissors, cut, 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 close the sponge. How fun. It looks like bunny feet when he's all pissed. It's like I done let daddy film videos when I'm hungry. See, it looks like feet. Good girl, go get a camera. It's like I done cuffed you. It looks like feet. Good girl. Look up there. Yeah, okay. okay. That looks like a mad bunny feet. But it is it is a kitchen sponge, so you can lather it up 
and then, cause that's your face when you're doing dishes. All right, snack. Next item! All right, unfortunately this is the last item in this box. And I'm Why? not really sure what it is. It doesn't have a description. It looks like a tablecloth. That's what I was going to say. But it says 35 on the outside, so. There's 35 tablecloths in there because it costs a dollar per tablecloth to pay $35 for this, and the rest of the items were just free. That's Mac there, honey bottom. Maybe they're lunch sacks. Can I have one? Oh, I see what it is. It's either a Good Burger hat. You know, like, you know, welcome to Good Burger, I'm a Good Burger, can I take you order? That, or you use it to strain your grapes. Cause see, there's little holes in there. There's holes inside this. So you might use it to strain your grapes. That's what I would have to say. Or maybe it's like a gift bag. But why would there need to be holes in it? And why would you need 35 of them? Obviously, you you do something with it long term. No, 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 short term because you use so many of them. It says, use these Samiko Garashi baggies to keep your kitchen sparkling clean. The cutest way to catch any rubbish in your sink. What? Why would you need to do that? I like my use for it better as a hat. So you put this in your sink. Yeah. But but the sink is too, the sinkhole is too. It's such a weird shape. Yeah, it's, it's rectangular. If you guys live in Japan, please take a picture and post what your sink looks like so I know if these will actually fit. <laughs> I think this entire box was a waste of money. This was not worth $35. I would have rather taken $5 and just bought the, the fun little ceramic dog uh, soy sauce dish. Because the sponge, yeah, it's fun. Would I buy one? No, because I don't wanna wash my dishes with Bunny Feet's face. This, I don't know what type of diet you're on where you only eat a uh, triangle of food, so that's useless. These are useless because I live in America and I have a garbage disposal. This is, I mean, it's, it's cute. But, but I'm it's... not gonna use it. So FYE, you guys let me down. You, you just stick to the snack boxes. The snack boxes are good. These things are not fun at all. It, uh, poor, poor quality. Ew, ew poor. This box is so poor, I'm upset that I spent $35 on this plus tax. I mean, it was nice doing something different that we don't usually do. I, so I will give it that. And the uh, soy I'm sauce dish it back. was super fun. I'm taking it back. I think it was nice to do something that we don't usually do. Yeah, some of the items are useless. I thought the soy sauce dish was super cool. But other than that, the sponge is cute. Meow, 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 meow. The little keychain is cute, but I'll probably never use it. I don't know, not highly satisfied with this. Not $35 worth. Yeah. Not, definitely not $35 worth. Six items for $35. We could probably have picked out six things for less than $35 that were yeah. a lot cooler. Worth $6. I think what you're paying for is the mystery. You're paying for the experience, the experience. but it's got to be profitable to them. And so I don't like it. Like if I this was Shark Tank, I'm not investing. I'm out. <laughs> I'm so disappointed. You know what, babe? Why don't what? we bring out some fun little items to spice this up and lighten up the mood? Ooh, she getting kinky. <laughs> sure, honey, go ahead. Go. All right, guys. Because the mystery box was so terrible, we decided to go into our little bag of fun goodies and we got three items. We have camel balls, strawberry gummy candy, and we have astronaut ice cream. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, astronaut ice cream. What does it taste like, Snack? Have you ever had it? I've never had it, but apparently it's a, like vanilla ice cream sandwich. Ooh, so let's see what the astronauts are eating up there on the space station. All right, we'll open up with the big one. Ooh, yes. Mm. Peep game on the ice cream sandwich. I'm a little scared. Mm -hmm. You want to extract? All right, this is mission ice cream sandwich extraction. It smells dry because it is. It's freeze dried, but you can kind of see the like ice cream sandwich mm. form that it's trying to take here. <laughs> See, it's, it's, it's definitely like one of those bluebell ice cream things, but dry AF. I feel like I'm eating like a foam piece of fruit, like a prop. <laughs> foam. This is what they use in the movies. For what it's worth, there's 21 grams of carbohydrates in this. Are you ready? Let's go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not pretty good. 
looking pretty good. We take the ice cream you know and love, and with the power of freeze drying, create a yummy new snack. And yeah, my snack. Am I gonna crave this? No. If I was starving on the International Space Station, yes. Next item! All right, snack, what are we doing next? Next, we're gonna do the camel balls. Ooh, balls. <laughs> These are camel balls, mm. which are allegedly extra sour chewy gum. <laughs> Just like, you know, how camel balls are. They're brown, but have like a gooey center. <laughs> Ball me. This is fun, they're individually packaged with a little camel with balls. Oh. It does look kind of like a caramel ball. It's very sticky. Camel ball. This is a mental game that we're playing here because I feel like, as it is now, I was like, oh, that's not bad. I'd probably eat it if it wasn't the way that it was. Like, if it didn't show that on the package. What would you say it tastes like? Almost like strawberry. I'm getting like a uh, mm. uh, ah! <laughs> Fee! What do you do? He jumped on top of me. Couldn't deal with the with the with the juicage when it pops in your mouth. There's like a cherry juice in the center, and when it just pops, it's and I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Next item. All right, this next thing we're doing is strawberry gummy candy, and it says Kasugai strawberry gummy candy is very delicious. I'll be the judge of that. It smells very Japanese. It smells like medicine. Mm. Ew. Mm. I don't like it. It tastes like lotus. Yummy. You know where they go for like having that real fruit flavor? Mm hmm I can't do it. I will not eat another one. It's not the worst thing I've ever had. No. But it's definitely not good. I can see where, where snack is coming from when they're going for like the real strawberry flavor. They just didn't nail it. And so I'll have to go two out of five on the star rating for that. Will not buy that again. Uh, I think we bought it just because I don't know what it says. In the English translation, it says strawberry gummy candy and it's gluten free. So all those out there who have a gluten allergy, you're in the clear. Want a little? No, I'm good. Fall 13? Yeah. Fall th Holy hell, the carbohydrates. Don't, don't 33 don't grams <laughs> carbohydrates. All right guys, that does it for today's video with the Dookie box. Cause it literally is Dookie because for $35 there was nothing useful in there except for the little uh, soy sauce ramekin. Is that is that a proper term for that? That's a good term. That's a perfect term. Soy sauce ramekin makes a little puffy. Oh wow. Somebody better go out and always go now. If you like the video guys, hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't like it, don't hit the thumbs down button. We don't like that. Subscribe, like, share, comment, tell all your friends, put comments in the comment section for which boxes you want us to do next. If you want us to spend money on a mystery box, you can actually get mystery boxes on eBay. Did you know that? Yeah. They have like a $10,000 mystery box. We're not doing that no. because I know it's not going to be worth it. Also, tell us what kind of food that you would eat freeze dried in space. What would you eat that's freeze dried in space? Pasta. Hot dogs. I would not eat a freeze dried hot dog. That I bet it would be, gross. it would be dusty. Yeah, that's, that's like, a, like a hot dog that melts in your mouth. Ah, <laughs> ah, hot dogs for the win. All right guys, we'll see you in the next video. This is my snack pack. We MF out here. See you guys later. Mm -hmm. Yummy out. <laughs>